He's seriously talking about 50 bombs, though. Okay, so it's a 31 kill win. Rezon drops a 31 kill game in EU finals. The only other two 30 bombs I know of, I know there's more, but Vico and Flixie have also done it. But Rezon's one of the first ones to do it and definitely one of the first ones to do it on stream. Very impressive game. Is he going to do... Ooh, okay, wait. He's not doing it from fencing and he's not doing it from snooty either. Ooh, okay. We've got a brand new spot for our 30 bomb. Pleasant Piazza. Piazza? Piazza? Interesting. Okay, I have not seen a single 30 bomb game from this drop spot. It is a hot drop, which helps massively. We've already just gotten a gun and a big pot on the roof. Are we going to Flowberry push this? Oh, we are aggressive. Okay, that was kind of clean though. Okay, wait. The low grab on the zip lines, kind of clean. On the grind rail, sorry. These are the ones you take full damage from as well, though, which makes fighting in this POI even more annoying. Yeah, he didn't go Yacht. Normally, he goes Yacht. Very interesting. I wonder if this will be his new solo drop because Rezon almost always goes the Yacht. This is the first time I've ever seen him drop here, and it's the first 30 more I've ever seen from this drop. There's three people here, though, so... I wonder if because it was a hot drop, it has more people. Ooh, this guy not very aware right now. What? Did that guy stop holding the build? Okay. I know a lot of people, especially in the comments of my videos, are always flaming NA like, oh, it's only on NA because they couldn't do it on EU. This lobby looking a bit NA right now, if you know what I mean, you know. Some of these mythic POIs the pros are dropping out only get like two kills before they rotate out anyway. Three kills now. I'm interested to see how much this game dies out. Ooh, EMP. Nice. Okay, wait a second. Little EMP off the right hand. Very underrated. Obviously, EMP is mostly being used to gain fish or gain gold, but 80 shield damage and you can throw them where they can't even see you is pretty solid. And ooh, this guy is aggressive. Oh my god, Jay, bro. Oh my god. Gold burn. Okay, I know why that guy was so aggressive now. Homie got the gold drum shotgun and just stood on his wall after getting hit for 100. Like nothing happened. He was ready to just jump in and hold left click. And we're currently AFK looking at another monitor. In a 31 kill win on EU finals. Wow. Okay. We've got the uh, well, React Antics trope coming out here. Did not one expect one this to be a 30 bomb. Uh, my my editor did send me the right video though. I know this much. Now, I guess he's going to push the forecast tower. Because that's guaranteed kills. Forecast tower guarantees you at least one or two kills. Someone is going to challenge for this, surely. Or is he going to just launch pad straight into Snooty? He is. He's going to launch straight into Snooty. I'm interested to see if he, get, if he takes Snooty shotgun or gold auto. I imagine Peter Pump. Oh, there we go. There's the one player pushing towards the forecast tower. I don't think... Yeah, nah, this is not the player with the medallion, though. And they are very much regretting shooting a reason. They are running. This guy does not want to fight. Oh, nice side jump. Oh, wait a second. Oh. This guy's putting up a really solid fire. We're down to 56 HP. We have no med kit here as well. No med kit, no medallion. So we're going to have to eat through a lot of our meds. That guy put up a good fight. Still 67 alive with four elims. So this game kind of died out a little bit. So he's, he's not going to push. Okay, he's not pushing for Peter Pump at all. Probably going to use the campfire. Okay. Very slow start to a 31 kill win. He's gone four kills between his start and the forecast tower. No mythic, no medallions. And he's having to use a campfire to gain his health back. This is a very interesting start. We've got the forecast tower boss finally spawning. Wow, the... AIs are, these AIs are really easy to kill. I'm kind of used to the uh, mythic bosses. All right, well, now we've got forecast as well, which when you're trying to drop 30 bombs, not as important, but it is still nice to know where next zone goes, especially in rotating zones. All right, so the pacing is about to start stepping up here. Only four kills with 62 alive. Oh, we got a bit of a third part. Even now, he's not, even, he's not grappling straight in. The pacing of this is so different to an NA 30 bomb. There, he has to play so much more careful. Like he's risking losing this kill. Because he wants to get in slow and, like, steadier. I'm surprised this even turns into a 30 bomb based on this early game pacing. Like, he's playing way too safe, you think, to go on and drop a 30 bomb. I guess, again, a lot of people are going to say that's just the difference. The EU lobbies are harder, so you have to play yeah. it smarter. Oh my God, really nice play. But again, he loses that kill because he waited until they died. 
I wonder if he was even like going for a 30 bomb. I know that sounds dumb, but now he got the Mythic Pump. Maybe he was scared to verse the player with the Mythic Pump medallion without a bit of an advantage. His chat is so supportive. W. Every time he gets a kill, just W, 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 W. So many Ws, bro. Just for a single kill, W, 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 W. Interesting to see him run minis over medkits there, especially with already having a medallion and three big pots. I would have thought medkits would be the play there, but it is only one medallion, I guess. All right, we got good rotates here with the launch pads. Looks like there is a player on the launch pad, I think. No. Yes, there is. No sniper, no ARs. So there's not much he can really do. He's going to have to just chase him, I guess. Oh, this player's holding up. The player might not know he's here. Peter Griffin glider. Not the glider I was expecting to be used for a 30 bomb. What the f... <laughs> this guy has instantly built four boxes on the reboot van like it's duos. Okay. We're, play we're versing a very defensive player here, but all oh, reason. With the read, beautiful peace control and oh, rams his head into the wall. Oh my god. Homie built a bunch of boxes and didn't even stay in them. And that was his biggest mistake. Oh, we're going to change the crash pad. Spin, bro. Nice. Okay. Good use of the crash pad there. This guy is unfortunately only got crash pads to run with. Crash pads versus infinite grappler. We normally know how this goes, especially with Rezon being able to reuse the crash pads that he's dropping. Not only reuse them, use them better than he is. He's at least sprint jumping on them. The other guy is not even sprint jumping. Oh, he's trying so hard. No, run, Jimmy. This is definitely little Jimmy playing on... Oh, no. Little Jimmy's playing on his console in the kitchen right now. Mom's got dino nuggies in the oven. He just wants to get his chance at $100. And meanwhile, Rezon... <laughs> Chases him across the entire map. Yeah, right, seven kills. Again, pretty slow pacing so far, but the lobby is staying nice and stacked. Only nine players have died since, like, we left spawn, like, five minutes ago. More. Hmm. Ooh. Did he get that wall? He d Ooh, decent oh. plays. Okay. The players are looking better on average than the NA30 so bomb. I will say that. As an unbiased observer, I'm not from either reason. Region? Reason? Damn it. Oh my god, that sub alert is so old from Rezon. I guess Rezon's been playing this game. He, like, Was Rezon's... Is das for... Was is das? Rezon's passion coming out. If Rezon's known for one thing, it's definitely his passion. And he's disengaging. Wow. I'm just... I mean, I'm... Yeah, it's gonna be me just yapping a lot about how EU and NA is so different, but wow. You just... This is not a 30 bomb on NA. My man is, like, crouch walking up to fights, letting the... Like, letting them kill each other. We're disengaging from fights. We're waiting for forecast towers. Like, he must get so many kills in the last, like, 10 minutes of this game because this is really slow pacing. But I guess, like I said, the EU lobbies are better, I guess. They stay more stacked. The players are playing more passive. So you don't need to, like, have that Peterbot play style of just running at people because they don't kill each other anyway. EU, like, there's still 53 alive. He's going to have to start getting some kills soon, though. I mean, I like the skill of being able to identify a player that's just not worth it, though. He could have wasted so long on that player and potentially even died anyway, so... All right, we've got someone here with the with the medallion. I think this is the player that just pre-fired him. They must have the AR or the SMG, though, because that wasn't the auto shotgun that he got pre-fired with, I don't think. And he's got the Peter Pump, so... Nice. Oh, good peace control. Gets the wall behind him as well. This player's now stuck on the low ground. He goes back into the box that Rezon already has the builds on. All right, is this going to be the Mythic AR or the Mythic SMG? I'm not sure. Oh, this player is pretty solid. The fights are taking so much longer. But again, no one's died. It's still 53 alive. You can take so much longer with your fights if the players in the lobby don't die. Maybe that's how he finally got the EU 30 bomb. It looks like he's ran into a lot of the good players in this lobby at the start and got him out early. All right, first hype battle we've seen so far. Not just all box fighting. And he goes down. I wonder if that guy has earnings. Oh my God. Oh my God. I don't recognize the name. It was Mythic AR. Okay, we're looking good now. Mythic AR, Mythic Pump, double medallion. I bet that guy has earnings. Okay, 52. No one is dying. What is going on? This is going to be a ridiculous rotating zone. He must get so many kills on rotating. Here we go. All right, forecast. Zone pulls back to where we are now. So a good zone pull to keep the game stacked as well. It's pulling back to congested side. So everyone's rotated from this south and uh, west side of the map. And then zone is bouncing all the way back. You can see it here, which means this game is going to stay a lot more stacked. Any player who's had to tank zone or shambles, they'll basically get a second chance, which will really, really help this game stay stacked. 
All right, that was one of the quicker fights we've closed out so far. So we're starting to get a bit of momentum going. Pro tip, if you guys want to check if someone's in a bush, all you got to do is pull your grapple out within range of it. If there's a player in it, you'll see the grapple marker on them. You can even use it to bait players who don't realize and then head snipe them. It's a very, very strong strategy. Super easy to do as well. Oh, player boxed up on a rift. That's not a good sign that they're a very good player, but Rezor knows that if that player gets the rift, he won't kill them. So he's boxing off the rift. He instantly positioned himself between making himself between the enemy and the rift so they couldn't run. And then he fully boxes it. He knew exactly what this player was trying to do. And look at that. Trying to get into the rift. Jumps into the full piece. Oh, they get away though. Again, even the players who are going to run put up a really good fight on EU. There we go. Goes in through the floor. One of the most reliable phase-ins. Okay, that guy I mean, had the mythic shotgun. shotgun as well? Oh god, I Wait, did he have a medallion though? I didn't see a medallion. What? Okay, interesting. Mythic shotgun, no medallion? And he's boxed up on a rift. Oh, he's on putting in some good damage with the assault rifle. Reloads it before he gets onto the other wall. And then the momentum phase in. We love it. Okay. Now we're picking up the pace. We're moving now. 46 alive, 11 elims. This is good. We are just pushing everyone now. Now it looks like an NA game. Unfortunately, we're pushing players who are deliberately boxed up on rifts. Oh, he gets the floor there. So he walked up there. He realized the player didn't have a floor, only the cone. Puts the floor through. And the player is forced to edit out straight into him. Okay, this is the kind of pacing I want to see. Oh, I'm scared here. Pushing a player inside a building. Oh, that is the scariest player. Someone sitting in a building like that with an auto shotgun and Rezon jumps in on no damage. If anyone's going to take him down, it's going to be that player right there. Doof, doof. All right, we got a few players nearby. Are we going to try and interrupt the fight so we don't lose this to a third party? There we go. Okay. Oh, no. Still playing it slower. Okay, I don't want to sound like a broken record. Every time I look at the player count, I'm expecting it to have dropped at all. If Rezon doesn't kill them, basically no one dies. I've never seen a game stay so stacked. We watched Cold yesterday, and Cold's game died out so quickly in the mid game. EU really playing for their main games. Rezon is going to give up on these fights potentially? Rezon slows down, chooses oh, to fuck, wait for bro. his medallion to top I'm him sorry, up. Oh, Zone pulls absolute max. I mean, he did know that. He has forecast, but. Oh, you always got to sip the water. Rezon, if Rezon's always staying hydrated. Bro, if you ever watched him play, I guarantee at some point throughout this endgame, he's going to take a big sip of water. Oh, player gets sniped trying to run. That's another Elim we I lose. Oh, nice pre-fire. This player is decent. That pre-fire was a very good indicator. This guy is quite solid. Holds the wall as well. So he's on decent ping. Rezon got that hard zero ping. Another pre-fire. Oh my God. These players are actually really good. This is, I'm just going to say it. Like I don't even need to check. This is 100% the hardest lobby we've ever seen someone drop a 30 bomb in. Without a doubt. It's staying stacked, which is good for the 30 bomb, but it's because the players are actually good. That was three pre-fires in a row on Rezon. Like, this person is very solid. This might be the most impressive solo victory finals game we've watched, and I've watched a lot. 13 kills, and we've had to earn them. There was a few freebies in there, but there are some really good players in this lobby. Oh, it's is the best spieler! And we're now getting sniped as well. Zone's pulling pretty far north now. And then the... Oh, the forecast. Okay. So next zone pulls deep into Lavish Lair. That's going to make the game stay even more stacked again. Because it's pulling back into a really big building. So any players who are shambles can just rat their way in and hide inside the building. Oh, we got Shieldfish and Medkits. That's nice. Shieldfish, very solid for just instant meds. Why is he trying to spray that wall out? Yeah, that guy was not the best example of how good this lobby is. But there's always going to be a few floppers. Oh. Nice tracking. Oh my god. It's the only problem with using the Fizzberry Jar in the open. The low gravity makes you very... Oh, there was a player in there. That's why you were spraying the wall. Whoops. I had no clue there was a player in there, but Rezon 100% knew. Waits for the reset. He knows the player is going to try no, and go for some of these refreshes. Oh, goes for the momentum phase. It doesn't build up enough right. momentum. The only problem is the more the more we elevate here, the more we're a target. But nice phase in. All right, we're going to have to try and hold some of these players for some freebies. We are. And oh my god. Rezon's aim at range with this assault rifle is really nice. It seems like the, the pros took a little bit to get used to the new weapons. No hit scan. But a few of them have definitely gotten used to these assault rifles. 
Wait, do you think yeah, Rezon deliberately up. shot that last wall to get it weak so the player could see the loot was in the box and then baited him into fighting for it? That is wow. That is insane. You're right. That's exactly what he was doing. I didn't even realize. Damn. Reason on those nice. Giga Brain strats. Okay. That's the again, it's the stuff you gotta do. If the lobby is this solid, you can't just run at everyone. You kinda gotta bait them. Alright, 17 kills, 31 alive. Here's where the pacing kicks up. We get 14 of the next 30 kills. Which in a lobby with good This is the good guy we're versing earlier. That was the solo player we versed earlier. Nice. Little chop piece control. Not much you can do to stop that. Can't take well, the wall twice in a row. Me, just make sure. Holds the shotgun out and goes for the pre-fire. Put the code in at the bottom of the screen. <laughs> Reason. I always play this map. Plug in the, the 1v1 map. map. And he's going, he's switching to English for it as well to make sure everyone knows. Oh, okay. Not the best awareness from this player after I've been hyping up the lobby. Okay. okay. Looks like the lobby, the Elam is starting to get a little bit more free now. So it's usually on this next zone or two where a lot of the NA players don't manage to get a lot of their kills. I'm interested to see how Rezon keeps up this pacing, even on rotating zones. I guess it's because there's still 20 alive. There's 23 players alive with 21 Elims and another sip of water. <laughs> Rezon living up to my... Uh... My statement earlier about always staying hydrated. I think Beam is just a habit. Oh. I think he just does it now. Pretty much yeah, after almost awesome. every chance he gets in endgame, if he takes his hands off his keyboard, he just sips his water. All right, we got the Fizzberry Jar Meg oh. Kit. Pretty much the best loadout we can have right now. Unless we're playing the heal off. With a lobby this stacked, it probably has to be going through Rezon's mind that he needs to also be ready for the heal off. Even dropping a 30 bomb, it could still go to heal off. Oh, nice shot. Beautiful angle. Oh my god. Okay, 555, five, five, double mythic, grapple, fizzberry, med kits. We are absolutely chilling. We are going to rotate front side though. So we're still playing smart for our elims. We're looking to get front and hold back. We're not just fighting people on backside. Another really nice chop. Gets the double piece control on top, but the player's already out of the box. Tries to go for the phase in. Gets it the second time. I wonder if this mo the momentum phase in is easier on zero ping or high ping. A lot of players tell me it's actually easier on higher ping, but Rezon and Polarize both do it the best, and they're both on hard zero. Dude, this could have been a 40 bomb. I mean, it would have been hard. It's, there we go. The 40 bomb's over. Travis Scott dead. 25 kills, and we are getting so many on rotating zones. All right, how big's the... How far up is high ground? It looks like high ground might be going for a little sky base from what I can see. Another chop out. Okay. Definitely picking up Rezon goes for a lot of chops in endgame. More so than I've ever seen anyone go for. It's good though, because you got that half a second delay where they can't build, where you always can get a free pump in. Nice. This assault rifle is actually getting Rezon as many, if not more, kills than the shotgun. Which is very surprising. Oh, takes the high ground. Nice aim. Doesn't miss a single shot on that player. Even with them dropping down and hitting the grapple. Trying to get doubles on anyone. Just working top down right now. So he's not playing high ground and spraying down, but he's also not giving up high ground. Looks like he's trying to play top down with double edits. Eight alive, 27 elims. Another What's sip of water. Really got to stay hydrated. Not scared to take his hand off the keyboard. All right. I think at this point he knows he's got the 30 bomb as long as he wins the game. He's only going to get a few of the remaining. That's another one. This could still go to heal off, maybe? One minute left until zones close out. There's still seven up. Okay, now the players are very weak. This really could explain why he got so many kills on rotating zone. It looks like his luck turned around a little bit on rotating zones. And the players were quite weak. Good read, though. That's the 30. He's got to secure the win now. He's got to kill one of the remaining three enemies. The chat's getting gassed. The Ws are being primed. The chat's already getting excited. Oh. Nice shot. Really nice low ground, low grab, high ground retake. He's still staying on his... He's still not cranking up and spraying down though. He could have easy DC ramp this and just sprayed down. But he's still playing wall to wall, box to box to get the last remaining kills. Oh, let's One go, kill bro. win on EU. That is let's the most go, impressive. Man. That's the most impressive 30 bomb we've oh seen. 100%. God. That lobby was actually really me? solid. 
Ich bin der Greatest, Bro. Damn, Holy Rezone shit. is nuts. 